Good morning, children. Let's continue with the fourth chapter in geography, this climate. Now here, we are going to study the average temperature and rainfall graph of both uh, Brazil as well as India. So here, now you have the annual average temperature and rainfall graph, okay, of four cities in Brazil, that is Manaus, Belém, Porto Alegre, and Rio de Janeiro. Okay, now here you find that rainfall is shown by means of the this graph, we call it as histogram. Okay, and the temperature is shown by means of a line graph. Okay, now here the pink, just see the pink line that is pink, that line graph will show you the maximum temperature, and the blue one will show you the minimum temperature. Okay. Now, here you find if you take Manaus, Belém, Rio de Janeiro and Porto Alegre, okay, you find there is, uh, you know, lot of difference in the amount of rainfall received as well as temperature, okay. Now, let us go into the questions pertaining to these two four, these four cities. Okay. Now, in which month is the highest temperature found in Manaus city? Okay. Now, first you are going to study the graph here. Okay. Manaus. So here you find the this city has receives the lowest temperature in lowest rainfall in the month of August. Okay. And the highest rainfall is received okay in the month of march understood children similarly you have the minimum okay minimum temperature okay is um, recorded in uh, the four you know four to five months that is january february march april may you find uh, then june july august september okay then you find the highest temperatures, okay. Highest temperatures are received, okay. In the, you find in the month of August, you find Manaus, uh, you find um, experiences a very high temperature, okay. Now, next that you have to understand is the, you know, uh, average annual range in temperature. So, what is this average annual range in temperature? That is the uh, maximum temperature, you know, experienced minus the minimum uh, temperature. Okay. So, let's come to the question here. In which month is the highest temperature found in Manaus city? Okay. So, highest temperature, just see. Okay. Can you see here? So, temperature is high during the months of April, August, September, October and November. Okay. Understood, children? So, when you come to highest temperature, it means the maximum temperature. So, you are going to see in this pink line, okay? This is a uh, line graph. So, the highest temperature is experienced in the months of August, September, October and November, okay? Then, in which month is the lowest temperature found in Porto Alegre city? Okay, now come back to Porto Alegre. Okay, so this is Porto Alegre. You find, okay, there's a drastic change. Okay, see, look at that. The maximum and minimum temperatures, okay, experienced by this. Okay, your question is lowest temperature. Okay, lowest temperature. So you'll have to look into the minimum temperature experienced by Porto Alegre. Okay, so here, look at that. The lowest temperature is experienced in the month of, okay, June, okay. So, and um, slightly, yes, uh, July also, okay. So, July is slightly more than June, but June and July you find the temperatures are low and further up it starts increasing, okay. So, 
in Porto Alegre, the lowest temperature is found in the months of June and July. Okay. In which month does it rain the most in Berlin? Okay. Now, come to, okay, here, Willem, uh, it rains the most, okay. So, highest, you have to look into this histogram, okay. So, you find the month of March, just see children, you have rainfall, the highest rainfall is received in the month of March, okay. Look at that. And rainfall goes on decreasing. You find here the rainfall goes on decreasing in the months of June, July, August, September. Okay. Then again, October again, it goes down. Okay. So, it rains. Okay. Uh, in which month does it rain the most in Belém? We find the highest rainfall is received in the month of March. Okay. In which month is the lowest rainfall recorded? in Rio de Janeiro city, okay? So lowest rainfall, okay? So come to Rio de Janeiro, okay? As I told you, the histogram here will show you the rainfall received, okay? The amount of rainfall, rainfall is in mm, okay? So in Rio de Janeiro, we find July gets the lowest, okay? Rainfall. Did you get that, children? If you look at the graph you find july gets the lowest amount of rainfall okay so if you okay find out it will be more or less say 40 millimeters okay so the lowest rainfall is recorded in the month of july in which month is the highest temperature found in all the four cities okay so, highest temperature in all the four cities, okay. So, for highest temperature, that is a maximum temperature, okay. You'll have to, okay, see this pink line, okay, line graph, okay. So, here you have August, okay. Here also you find, again here, okay. So, Belém also, you have August, and here also, see, Rio de Janeiro also. So, you find in the month of August, uh, highest temperature, I said, okay. So, just a minute, children. So, highest temperature, see here, we have in the month of March here, okay. Then here also Manaus, then Belém also, okay. Then here again. Okay, you have more or less in the month of March, you find the highest temperature is found in all the four cities. Then, six one, what type of climate is found in Rio de Janeiro? Okay, so climate, now if you look at the uh, maximum and minimum temperatures, we find there is a vast difference in Manaus. Okay, Belém is more or less, uh, you know, slightly, you know, uh, better. Okay, then uh, you find you look at Porto Alegre. Again, you find there is a vast difference in the maximum and minimum temperatures. But here in Rio de Janeiro, we find more or less it is equal. Okay, next is you'll have to find. Okay, so here. Uh, the difference between the maximum and minimum temperature, suppose we take, we find it will be minimum. So, uh, in Rio de Janeiro, we find the climate is uh, mild and also humid because it is along the uh, coastal region. Okay. Which city has the maximum range of temperature? Okay. How much? Okay. Now, as I told you, uh, what is this maximum range? Okay, range in temperature is the uh, highest temperature minus the lowest temperature. So, okay, so if you look at Manaus, you find, you look at the maximum temperature and minimum temperature, you find there's a vast difference. Okay, so um, uh, this is, uh, you know, the maximum uh, temperature. Okay, uh, here, look at that. It will be, okay. 
the maximum temperature will be around say 30 okay 34 okay right okay children the maximum temperature uh, in manos is about 34 degree centigrade okay next let us come to the cities in india okay here we have the uh, average annual range of temperature as well as rainfall in the four cities of india that is delhi kolkata mumbai and chennai okay so if you have a look at these four cities we find um, you know uh, if you look at just look at the map of India here, you'll find uh, coastal uh, cities. That is, those cities which are along the coastal regions have a milder climate. Okay, and it is also the climate also will be humid. Okay, and we find the range in temperature will be very very low. But look at the uh, look at the city of Delhi. You find there is a vast uh, difference in the you know. As such, you find the average annual range in temperature, you know, there's a vast uh, difference here, okay, because Delhi is located, is centrally located, okay, and as such, you find it is far away from the influence of the sea, okay, as um, I had explained in the previous uh, graphs here, the rainfall is given in millimeters and it is shown by means of a histogram, okay, the pink line here pink that is the pink and the blue line will show you the line graph and the pink line uh, graph okay line graph will show you the maximum temperature and the blue line okay will show you the minimum temperature okay understood children okay now let's come to the questions which are based on this from among the four cities, which city has a maximum temperature? Now, maximum means, children, it is the highest temperature. Just see, here in Delhi, you find it is more than 40. Okay, look at the pink line. Okay, so in summer, you find Delhi records more than 40 degrees centigrade. Okay, here, nowhere, nowhere is 40 degrees centigrade. Look at that. Even Kolkata will be more than 35. Okay, here... Chennai is not yet, it will be say 39, okay, then maximum temperature here, children, Mumbai, okay, it is less than 35, okay, 34, so which, which city here among the four will show, will have the maximum temperature, children, it is of course Delhi, okay, in which month does Delhi experience the highest temperature? okay highest temperature is recorded in delhi in which month look at that children where is the highest temperature here it is above 41 so which month is it we know it is march i mean it is may okay so delhi records a high the highest temperature in the month of may from amongst the four cities which city experiences minimum temperature minimum means children lowest Okay, now you'll have to go to the um, this uh, line graph that is uh, the blue one. Okay, the lowest temperature. Look at that, children. So here it is, um, say six. Okay, then come to Kolkata. It will be nine. Okay, the minimum temperature here in uh, Chennai is twenty-one. Okay, and in Mumbai, it will be say 70. Okay, so which city shows the lowest temperature, children? It is, of course, Delhi. Okay, so from amongst the four cities, which city experiences minimum temperature? It is Delhi. In which month does it rain the most in Mumbai? Okay, so come to Mumbai. Which graph will show you the rainfall, children? It is a histogram. Histogram, rainfall is shown in millimeters. In which month does it rain the most? Look at the histogram, children. We have rainfall in June, July, August, September, a little bit in October, then some in November. 
so in which month is the rainfall more it is in july okay so just see children it is more than 800 okay uh, mm okay so in which month does it rain the most in mumbai it is in the month of july which are the months when mumbai doesn't get rain okay children just see look at that mumbai doesn't get rain children it is in see look at this february it doesn't get rain march it doesn't get rain april it doesn't get rain and december also it doesn't get rain so mumbai doesn't get its rain in february march april and december okay so you'll have to see the uh, where the graph is not there that is the histogram is not there on the other hand look at that children see delhi gets practically rain in almost all the months see look at that even uh, kolkata gets rain in all the months okay chennai also okay but mumbai see in mumbai we don't have rainfall for the months of february march april and december okay and okay then in which month does chennai receive heavy rainfall okay now chennai heavy rainfall look at that children it is here in the month of november okay now if you look at mumbai slight rain is there children okay very very slight okay so uh, the previous question as i said mumbai does get a slight rainfall in the month of december so the months where we don't have rainfall is february march april okay slight amount of rainfall we do get in december that is because of this you know cyclonic uh, storms okay and uh, because of the uh, north east uh, you know winds retreating monsoon winds which give rainfall to chennai okay in the month of in the winter season slight amount a slight amount of rainfall is received by mumbai also okay so uh, in the months of february march and april uh, mumbai doesn't get rain chennai receives heavy rainfall in the month of november in which city is a range of temperature minimum okay now as i said what is the range of temperature children range of temperature is the maximum temperature minus the minimum temperature is it not so if you look at mumbai we find here the range of temperatures that is range of temperature is very very is comparatively low if we take delhi for example see look at the range of temperature that is 21 minus say 6 okay such a high range of temperature it is but here look at that 31 minus say uh, 16 okay the range of temperature is you find comparatively lower when you uh, compare it with delhi kolkata and even say chennai okay so the range of temperature is minimum in mumbai city based on the temperature of these four cities which is equable and which has extreme climate okay as i told you children those cities which are along the coast okay see look at the map here okay those cities which are along the coastal region we have mumbai here we have chennai here in the south and again kolkata is also along the coastal region so you find in kolkata chennai and mumbai we have equable climate and we have delhi which is you know is centrally located so in delhi we have you know extremes of climate okay children so based on the temperature of these four cities which has equable and which has extreme climate mumbai kolkata chennai have equable climate and delhi has extreme climate okay children so today you this is uh, these two you know maps of the cities in india as well as brazil you know are um, given in your textbook children it is just to familiarize yourself with you know graph reading that i have taken it here okay so children it's very very important that you go through the graph you understand how to uh, read the graph okay so we have questions based on this in your uh, board exam so 
uh, pay attention to this children understand how to read the graph okay children so here we complete chapter 4 of your you know of climate okay thank you children